Are you struggling with figuring out the Facebook domain verification? Well, if you're hosting on GoDaddy, check this out. I'm gonna walk you through exactly how to verify your domain between Facebook and GoDaddy. All right, so taking you inside a dummy account once again, I am going to walk you through exactly how to set up the Facebook verification. So if you are in your business manager, so again, you go to business.facebook.com. This is your main homepage. If you go under business settings and then scroll down to brand safety domains, you will need to add your domain. So in this case, I'm going to do tuckedinmarketing.com. Don't include the www or the HTTPS. Click add domain and a lot of times nothing will happen. So then refresh your page and voila. As you see here, you're gonna have three ways of verifying your domain. I have walked you through the meta tag verification between Facebook and Shopify. So if that's the route you'd like to take, go check out another video. I'll put the link down below for easy access, but that'll help you to just add a code right onto the Shopify site. If you do have access to the hosting, and in today's case, in my case, I'm going to walk you through GoDaddy since that's the domain uh, registrar that I use, we would go in through the DNS verification. So the first step is to log into GoDaddy. So I've logged in. And what we're going to do next is we're going to add this text right into the DNS configuration. So, and you've selected the URL or the domain that you'll be connecting or verifying on Facebook. Scroll down to manage DNS. And once you are in DNS management, then you basically need to add and the type that you are going to be adding is txt record. So add txt and under host, it tells you to add the at sign. So then you put the at sign under host and then the value is the value that you just copied here. Then you click save and then you come over here and you click verify. Oh, you know what? Uh, what then happens is that it this needs time to propagate and for that new DNS setting to really stick. And so once that's done, when you click on verify, it will connect. So I hope this helps. This is another way you can verify your domain on Facebook if you do have access to your domain hosting. If you're doing this for clients, a lot of times you may not have access to their domain registrar and that's where meta tag verification could be very helpful. So once I waited a couple of seconds to make sure that the TXT record stuck on the GoDaddy side, I clicked verify once again and look, the domain is now verified, voila. I hope that was helpful. Thanks for watching.